with Tesla Texas Gigafactory nearing completion, Tesla is set to release the Model Y 2.0, which will have the 4680 battery inbuilt. The batteries are charged to propel the Model Y 2.0 to a whole new level as they offer some amazing features. Let's find out whether or not they are overhyped by looking at some facts about the 4680 battery. has to do with the cylindrical battery size. The Tesla Model S and X currently use 18650 cells in an 18 mm by 45 mm pack, while the Tesla Model Y uses the 2170 cells, which is in a 21 mm by 70 mm cell pack. The 4680 battery cell, however, to be used by the Model Y 2.0 is a lot larger than others as it uses 4680 cells in a 46 mm by 80 mm millimeter cell pack and with this form factor change the battery has five times more energy than the previous battery packs the effect of this is that the 4680 batteries hold more energy up to 86.5 watt hours this breakthrough in battery manufacturing is made possible by tesla's tabless battery technology experts say that the new 4680 structural battery packs could contain 960 battery cells in a 40 by 24 cell arrangement, which allows for a 10% mass reduction compared to the 4416 cells of the 21 by 70 cell battery pack that make up the long range model Y and long range model three. There is obviously an improvement in Tesla technology based on the statistic as rather than put 4,400 cells in a pack, you put 960 cells in a pack, which improves the process and makes it easier to produce the battery packs. For the large form of the 4680 batteries, the tabless technology is critical. Ideally, when normal batteries are charging or discharging, the stored energy travels through tabs connected to the battery's electrodes, and the longer the tabs are, the longer it takes for the energy to flow. The implication is that so much heat is generated due to added resistance to the energy flow by the tabs. This, of course, will damage the battery, hence the introduction of management battery systems and a cooling element built into the battery packs. Also, a normal battery has the anode, cathode, and separator elements connected in a jelly roll design. This design means that the larger the cell diameter, the harder it is to cool the interior of the battery, which in turn can lead to slow charging time and other issues with regards to performance of the battery. But this system is necessary to avoid heat when batteries are charging. The tabless technology of the 4680 batteries, however, solves these problems because it eliminates the tabs and also reduces the electrical parts from 250 millimeters to 50 millimeters, so the diameter is less. This helps to create less resistance, which of course creates less heat during charging as well as discharging. Tesla can also build a cooling plate to cool the battery cells into the design. Another fact that makes the 4680 battery distinct is the Tesla manufacturing process for them. Tesla has a simplified manufacturing process for the battery packs, and this allows for mass production as they can produce so many batteries in such little time. This, of course, will also allow for production at a lower cost, which is indeed amazing because the owner of a Model Y 2.0 will get a super battery in a supercar at a reduced cost. The battery cells, as a result of advanced technology, are also going to be produced in smaller footprints, but at the same time, they will have more power, up to one terawatt per hour of battery. This is a vast improvement on their current production of 150 gigawatts per hour batteries, which also take up more space. The process of manufacturing the cathodes for the batteries is also vastly improved for optimal results and, of course, lower cost. QuantumScape has estimated that it will be able to provide low-cost batteries in about five years, which is good news for the automobile industry. What is great news, though, is that Tesla plans on greatly reducing the cost of their battery packs as early as 2022, starting with the 4680 batteries. Tesla has mentioned that with all the improvements in the manufacturing of their batteries, they will be able to reduce the cost of their batteries. They have estimated a possible 56% reduction 
of the cost per kilowatt per hour of their packs. The cost of running the factories for production is also estimated to have a reduction of about 69% of the cost of investments per gigawatt hours when all the improvements are perfected. This means that we get to have the cost benefits of solid space battery technology sooner. The 4680 batteries also have high energy density gains similar to QuantumScape, which is in a report on QuantumSpace.com at the cell level. The density gain of the 4680 batteries at a cell level could be up to 40% greater than that of the 2170 batteries, which is their current technology. The postulation is due to the report by Tesla on the range increase in the 4680 batteries of up to 54% compared to the 2170 batteries. The connection between the range increase and the energy density gain is that if you have a denser cell, there will be a higher range. So, if you have a 75 kilowatt per hour battery pack in the Tesla Model Y, and you can fit in a battery pack of about 86.5 kilowatt per hour in the same space, the battery has to be more energy dense. The energy density of the new 4680 batteries is estimated to be about 346 watt hours per kilogram at the cell level. There will also be more improvement of the energy density at the pack level because of the structural battery pack and the cell designs. The improvement is estimated to be about 54% at the pack level, and based on 2019 data from Tesla, this will lead to 245.6 kilograms for a 75 kilowatt battery pack rather than 305.4 kilograms, which means a 35% reduction in the weight of their battery packs. So, with this new battery, you can have more cells in a battery pack and still have a lighter pack than previous ones. The Model Y 2.0, as a result of this energy density gain, will be more efficient and more nimble to drive. The futuristic QuantumScape battery technology has a fast charging speed of up to 0 to 80% in less than 15 minutes. Tesla's 4680 batteries, which are to be achievable as early as next year, have a similar charging speed and are estimated to charge from 0 to 80% in less than 15 minutes as well. Due to the tabless technology, the batteries will be able to significantly reduce heat during charging and discharging, which in turn affects the thermal aspects of the charging equation, and the batteries will also be able to accept the high rate of charge or power without overheating. The lithium plating, cathode, and anode materials of the 4680 batteries also contribute to the charging speed. For instance, Tesla has said it will increase the percentage of silicon used in its anode production, which is guaranteed to improve charging speed. That's it for today's video. Let us know what you think of this battery and the Model Y 2.0 down in the comment section. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to TechBang if you are not already subscribed. Stay safe and we'll see you in the next video.